Would you like to become a master strategist? Well, this video is for you. In today's video, we take a look at how leaders become strategists by analyzing Richard Rumelt's book, The Crocs. We share five lessons that will make you rethink everything you know about strategy. Keep watching and you will learn the secrets to strategy. It starts with diagnosing challenges and putting coherent solutions into action. These lessons will make you an effective CEO. Richard Rumelt, an eminent strategist and management theorist who taught at Harvard Business School. He defines strategy as an ongoing process of identifying critical challenges and deciding what actions to take. It's a thorough conversation about the real challenges facing the firm and the creativity required to find transformative solutions. Drawing on a range of intriguing examples, Rumelt shows us both how this can be done and the enormous benefits of doing it. Today, we present five key lessons from his book to illustrate how this process functions. Before we continue, please remember to like and subscribe for more tips. Lesson 1. Recognize the distinction between strategy and management. Rumelt warns that motivating employees to achieve their goals is management work, not strategic work. Neither is more important than the other. But we must identify the difference. Managers focus on execution and ensuring that tasks are completed. Success is only achieved after you create a strategic plan. According to Rumelt, a collection of objectives or measurements is not a strategy. A strategy is a well-reasoned argument regarding the forces at play and how to respond to them. Don't let stats drown out your ability to think. Lesson 2. Your current financial performance is a result of plans you had before. Rumelt draws attention to the fact that present earnings are the harvest of investments and activities performed in the past. It is erroneous to believe that profits are merely the product of hard effort by today's managers and staff. This may seem obvious, yet it is also fairly easy to disregard. The author wants to emphasize that an excessive reliance on short-term success measurements can be deceptive. They consume time and resources that could be allocated to strategy. Lesson 3. Create a strategy rather than choosing one. The author believes that leaders who are skilled at strategizing tend to have a sense for what's important and focus efforts in that area. They do evaluate data and review available analysis, but they prioritize core business without being distracted. This concentration prevents them from wasting time. They do not view strategy as a definite account of the future. According to them, planning is being aware of difficulties and possibilities that arise. Lesson 4. Reframe the issue such that you can observe it properly. Rumelt argues that leaders who focus on the positive and mask the negative frequently impede an organization's ability to accurately diagnose its problems. Asking straightforward, non-judgmental, Questions such as why is this difficult can aid in resolving such a scenario by revealing the overlooked principles. This method identifies areas in which individuals want assistance. Sometimes, they will only confide in others who guarantee confidentiality. Rumelt states, diagnosis is essentially a process of focusing on problems and repeatedly asking what and why until you find the answer. Lesson 5. Do not begin with goals. Rumelt notes that misunderstanding the connection between goals and strategy might lead to frustration. Without a proper diagnosis, decisions based only on a declared goal lack a strong foundation. It's just an arbitrary objective, according to Rumelt. It's detached from reality. It is not in sync with possibilities and problems. A good goal must eliminate uncertainty. It should be one that the organization understands how to achieve by making clear decisions. Remember strategy is an ongoing process of identifying critical challenges and deciding what actions to take. Thank you so much for watching our video, click the like button now to support our channel and click subscribe if you want to get notified each time we post a new summary.